Hello everyone, this is coming from Lotus. Today we want to give you the experience and the method that we start to design and produce roll foaming machine. We have some example here for you. Customer give us this drawing and we make a section drawing for him. You can see it has some size, we already confirmed with customer, so we start to draw it by Katia, software, step by step. We know the R size, and we using the function in the Katia to design the section. You can see, our size is 3.05 and secondary is 2.2 .2. so now I choose it the secondary part 202 this is the direction and here we go okay after this finish we're going to next part because we have the angle we cut it so we're going to our size 4.62 again As you can see, it's a bit different, but that's why I want to show you as a sample or as a processing for design and start fabrication or forming machine. In Lotus, we have a different software and different engineering to a step-by-step -step design, analyze, and finalize the roller shaft. Then we go to fabrication. This profile using for greenhouse film locking is much popular in the European market, Middle East and we have sold several different lines for exactly film locking so half is finished i make a mirror it's completely finished now i want to make a thickness for that here we have a 0 0.9 the thickness so i going back to katia give it to a sketch okay yes the length 20 millimeters, thickness 0 0.9, confirm. Here we go. This is our final products after roll forming, and this is what customer need. So now we're going to start design roll forming machine based on this requirement. Okay, let's go to UTCAD. First of all, in Katia, we make a flower pattern, one by one. It's the one, two, three, four. You can see it's almost 90 degree. Five, six. It becomes joined together. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13 is almost going to finish and here we go it's 14 so within 14 a roller station tooling a stand we can finalize this profile based on our design now we go to AutoCAD to show you one by one roller shaft and what's the design method for us this is the view of the left side of the machine 
you can see roller up roller down roller stand here the side roller 11 to 12 and total is 14 station what I want to show you now is one by one the up roller and down roller this is that no any other supplier for all for me machine will show you and will discover for you but as you know Lotus we are well open for sharing the information and knowledge that we have so here you are this is all 14 station last station that you can see your product almost finished it's finalized let me take it out for you the red part is material inside the rollers I put it here you can see so it has a two side roller one up one down here we go we start from zero and first station first of all the input material is 51 millimeter widths let me change it to English input material widths 71 millimeters material thickness is 0 0.9 millimeter and the roller shaft is 50 roller diameter shaft diameter is 50 so here is the station one we call it a station you can say tooling stand or whatever you call it the red between two roller is material coming inside the first station a little making angle second station you can see two left and right side is almost closed by the down roller yeah number three you can see it's going to secondary angle in station four we almost two end become 90 degree so from now on we coming twisted back let me take the profile out of this and you can see after four station what become a flat material in our forming machine from here we start to bend it back to side let me compare for you from station 4 to station 5 what's the difference and what's, what will be change on machine here we go and station 5 and station 4 Let's go to station six. We almost twist it back, tight it together. Now we come up to make a secondary curve in the middle. Here you are. For producing this roller, we need exactly this drawing and this size. And as you know, before we start fabrication we need the analyze test and review by our engineering several times 11 station 11 going to finish you can see from now on we're going to side roller to make a bend in the inside angle we don't call it uh, station and we don't count it because it doesn't drive by gear or it doesn't drive by motor it's just driving and moving by the material here is the left part let me show you the difference from here to there here from here we're coming to hook it together two side roller 
station 12, station 13, and station 14. It has a two side roller, except up and down, it has a two side roller. Here, I compare with you station 12 and station 13. What's the difference? Yeah, this is come from station 12. We put it here. Let's go, it's finished. We almost finished and almost done here. Our last station is a torque head that we use it for alignment and twisting and modifying the final products. So let's come back to Katia. I will show you station 14 and station 13 by Katia 3D here I put the final product here material is galvanized and thickness is 0 0.9 up roller down roller so I want to match it together all in the right position I will move it for you, then you realize if we don't adjust and if we don't modify the roller position, what will happen during our roll forming. You can see, left, it's too much. It should be exactly in the middle of the line. When in down profile, it's not in the middle. So I move it. until all section cross together it becomes zero it's still not correct let me move up roller yeah You can see during roll forming, during up roller and down roller, what will happen with our material and what we made. Down roller connecting with shaft and chain. Here is the bearing. Go to assemble. So let's go to machine. Show you a step by step on Katia. Okay, here is the station one. Station two, the orange color is the material going through. Down shaft, up shaft, bearing, roller, as you can see. I'm moving a little fast, but later you can watch again and pay attention to difference from each stand to second level. So once we're telling you it need a professional designer and professional software operator to design or form a machine, we mean this. Till now, I changed three software for you, AutoCAD, Katia, and we are analyzed by Abacus. So before fabrication, we should make sure each size, each design is correct. Here you go. This is the final station or final products or side roller. Now we go complete our machine, body frame, the stand for keeping the bearing, up roller, down roller, chain transmission. Now I want to take you to workshop and check how we make it from software to reality. This process almost taken three months from design to delivery the machine to customer. But so far, we're going to deliver this machine almost 70 days. 
this is the day 70 this machine required also very small hole punching this is input raw material coming inside press the station up and down hole view I show you as you can see from here you can see up roller and the material coming through here's the punching hole it's customized by customer it's not that easy that you see but it takes so much effort to finalize this machine so hope you enjoy from our videos we try to show you how professional we are and how capable we are on the design and fabricate reforming machine based on your requirements. Hope you enjoy. See you next time. Bye.